Hi, Zez. How Hello. are you? I'm good, thank you. <laughs> Thanks so much for having me in Circus Network. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> thank you for this. <laughs> no worries. So, I want to start about um, this passion that you have for animation. Yeah. And I want you to tell us a little bit how that came into being in your life. All right. So, I was studying uh, graphic design and I had like... Um, I had uh, one subject that was animation on the course, and uh, and I, I fell in love with it. I also I've I've been like a really really big fan of cartoons uh, since I was a baby until now, really. What type of cartoons? Uh, Cartoon Network was the that, that's where I learned English actually. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we all did in Portugal. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> And uh, and so after that graphic design course, I studied uh, animation in uh, Birmingham in the UK, and um, and I've been a freelancer ever since. Yeah, so for twelve years now. Yeah. Okay, that's a long time. It's a long time. And do you enjoy your everyday? Uh, uh well. E you know, everyone has this, its own spe specific problems and uh, uh, th maybe the, the problem with freelancing is never knowing what the next month will be, right? Of course. But what I noticed was that uh, it was like, um, uh, the, the graph was like this, okay. you know? So at the beginning, the, nothing really happened and I had stayed at my parents' house for, for a few years, right? Yeah. And, um, and and then when when, when things start uh, uh, kicking off, it really it it, it became like a, a viable uh, career. Okay. <laughs> so uh, since the pandemic, that's when remote work really opened up, and I uh, got to work to wherever really uh, from around the world, you know, like. Uh, that, that's so you when, work also not only for Portuguese market but for yeah. foreign markets. Yeah, absolutely. I, I I try to still work to the Portuguese market, mm -hmm. but but I uh, I mostly work for like the United States or the rest of Europe or Canada or mm -hmm. that's usually the, the clients that I that I get. Okay. Yeah. So you. Um, you consider yourself a full-time artist then? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, for now. Yeah. <laughs> Good. And what is your favorite feeling and why? My favorite feeling? Expressing myself, I guess. Okay. <laughs> uh, this animation work that I do mostly it's uh, it's commercial work, so it's not it's it's not it doesn't feel very artistic, you know. Mm -hmm. But other than that, like uh, all the all the things that I do on the side, uh, uh, like um, if I um, uh, I also I I play drums, and so I I would get to do the the music videos and have animation in in those, and that feels really good, you know. And uh, okay. like all the side projects, I try to include animation in them. That's when I feel artistic. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So your favorite feeling is expressing yourself. That's yes. where you find happiness, right? Yeah. Yeah. And. Uh, why, why is that? Why do you feel like... Because uh, I think uh -huh. all artists kind of have that uh, yeah. that feeling, right? Because yes. we want to express ourselves, but we also want to, um, to you know, be recognized as well, you know, for yeah. expressing ourselves, basically. Yes. So there's also always a reason, like, why does that make us so yeah. happy? I ask you. <laughs> yes, yes, that, that, it's a it's a tough it's a tough one, but uh, <laughs> I guess um, I guess in, in Portugal, and maybe it's because my name is José Manuel, which is a mm. really common name, <laughs> right? Yeah. Uh, I, I, I don't I don't want to be another another José Manuel, mm -hmm. you know. I, I uh, the, uh, hence the 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 the, uh, the name change to Zez, and uh, and and uh, I. I guess I just want 
people to to know that wh what I think differently or mm -hmm. like I, I do cartoons as well uh, like a comic uh, uh, stuff like New Yorker cartoon mm -hmm. type you know where I can express an idea very quickly animation is a, a, an amazing tool to to uh, to, to express uh, and mm -hmm. also music you know and and then combining everything it's it's just perfect yeah <laughs> <laughs> and um, what is your morning routine? My morning routine? Coffee? Yes. <laughs> and then uh, uh, emails and <laughs> computer <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> after effects. <laughs> and that you are one of those people that kind of has like discipline and wakes up early and all that kind of thing or are you like more you know, night kind of guy or... Yeah, I used to be a lot more uh, um, night kind of person. Like I, I used to, to, to work a lot at night and uh, lately I've been trying not to work uh, past dinner <laughs> whenever possible. Okay. So I, I wake up uh, earlier uh, for, for a few years now. And um, uh, yeah, but that's just because I don't, I don't want to work the, uh, throughout the night. Yeah. <laughs> and why did you change uh, um, th that kind of routine? Why uh, did you feel the yes. need? Uh, was it because you felt like uh, you changed? Uh, so the routine changed with you or it, were you like uh, something forced you to change or? Maybe something forced. It was okay. a pandemic. Because uh, <laughs> uh, uh, there were like a few months that were really hard to get any job. Mm -hmm. and, and I just slept better. And uh, and I try to I'm trying to sleep better or, okay. or sleep at a decent uh, hour, you know. <laughs> that that's okay. probably it. It was a pandemic, yeah. Okay, <laughs> I think the pandemic changed a changed lot of lives. Lot, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, this is a tough one. Uh, cool. For what do you live? Um. Uh, yes, that's that's a tough one. Uh, I live for, um, I want to say friends and family. <laughs> okay, answer. Yes, I guess so. And trying to, to do just a little better, mm -hmm. a little something better to the world. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, I mean, in every interaction, I try to, like... Maybe bring a smile, maybe, mm. maybe, hopefully, yeah. Bring kindness into the world. Yes, girl. yes, hopefully, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, that should be it. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to answer for you. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> I think that's it. <laughs> what makes you feel most fulfilled? Um, so, uh, maybe expressing myself. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, th through animation or music, yeah, th those are my favorites, yeah. Okay. And um, just a, a little side question. So you told mm -hmm. me you play drums, so do you yeah. have like a, a band or did you used to have a band? Yes. So I, I used like to... like an old love of yours? Yeah, yours? well, well I, I used to have a, a, a band since I was a teenager, like, like punk rock bands, because mm -hmm. when you don't play that well, Punk rock is a nice place to start, <laughs> and uh, and my last band stopped w with the pandemic because the okay. um, uh, my friend went to uh, the Netherlands actually, and um, and so we had to stop uh, doing shows and all. And uh, well, right now I'm actually I'm I'm doing music on the computer and uh, and I'm trying to bring this uh, character, this cartoon character, to to life. Uh, uh, like a, a virtual band, like, uh, uh, a so, punk rock character. Sort of. It's more like nice. it's more pop now, but, <laughs> okay. but, but it's like a. The times change. Yeah, well. exactly. We, uh, I listen to bedroom pop or whatever, <laughs> and uh, and uh, and it's like it's sort of like a, a, you know how the gorillas are like a virtual band that that uh, mm -hmm. they, they play their shows, but but it, the cartoons are like the the faces of the the band. I want to do that with a, with a, with this character. So I don't want to be on the on the spotlight. Mm -hmm. uh, I want a cartoon to do to do that for me. Yeah. <laughs> Great. What do you do when you feel at your lowest? Um. What's the name? Uh, a fittest position. <laughs> and. <laughs> 
and I guess just I just go back to basics. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I go back to where I came from. <laughs> Uh, when I'm at my lowest, yeah, yeah that's that. I, I I just feel like I can't move, and and usually uh, if I'm at my lowest, mm. th that's that's what happens, and I'll, I'll just put on YouTube and, and and you know keep watching the news. That's something I I, I do a lot, and uh, and I just wait, you know, yeah. uh, if I can, I, j I just wait until I get the. I get on the flow again, and usually it doesn't take too long, so maybe I'm lucky with that, you know? Mm -hmm. the, so, yeah. Okay. Fetus and, position. Uh, <laughs> yeah. That, I never heard that before, so that's new yeah. for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it looks like a good solution. It's a good time. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, do you usually, um, does your work uh, thrive as well from sadness? No. No, I know people who who can only like write or, uh, uh, or or come up with something when when they're sad or or, or mad or, but but I I, I can't. Mm -hmm. I, 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 like today, I woke up singing, and that only happens when when I'm when I'm uh, when I'm when I'm good, you know, when, okay. I, when everything's cool, yeah. uh, and I noticed that right away. Like the the days that I. Just don't feel like singing. <laughs> that, yeah. That's that is, um, a bit of a bummer. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you already know yourself so so much yeah. that you, you already can yeah. sense the day they are go you're going. Yes. Back. Yes. Something like that. Yeah. yeah. That's good. Um, <laughs> and about um, also the workshop. Oh, the workshop. Sorry, the no. workshops that you're doing for subcultures. Yeah. So you're doing a little bit more on the motion design side, right? Yes. Yes. And uh, can you tell us a little bit what people might expect from uh, the workshops? Yep. Because you talked so much about animation and cartoons. Yes. And is that incorporated as well? And uh, how are people gonna? get access to that side as well through the workshop. Right. So um, usually I, I, I do a character animation on, on After Effects. I mm. also use uh, some other uh, software. But um, After Effects is a great place, great place to start. And it's, a, it's kind of a difficult uh, uh, software to, to get into. On, on the workshops, I, uh, I uh, give like an introduction to, the, to After Effects mm -hmm. uh, to, to people. And uh, I go through a lot of the different stuff that you can make with the software. So you can uh, animate uh, poster designs, letters, characters, uh, uh, like animated explainers. Uh, that's something that commercially I do a lot. Like a lot of brands want to showcase a product. And um, like uh, most of the commercials you see on TV have after effects somewhere, you know, yeah. and uh, um, uh, and yeah, uh, uh, you can also use uh, After Effects to create animations with characters that that's, uh, that are really good, mm -hmm. and um, it's part of w what I teach. Yeah. Okay. And now maybe we can check some uh, some works. Some works. Right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll just open the computer. So people in the workshop can bring already an idea and you can uh, work with them? Yeah, sure. That. Uh, I, that's something that I'll definitely have... Um I'll, I'll definitely have uh, uh, something to start with, but mm -hmm. if if people have like something that they really want to uh, accomplish or, or, or animate, I can totally uh, work with that. Yeah. Okay. Sound. So this is something that I. This is a music video that that I created uh, for for the band that has um, for my my last band that has just a lot of um, mixture between uh, well, bad <laughs> characters. Stop, right? uh, yes, yes, some stuff. <laughs> That's gonna be a arcade piece. I style. know. I know. I went, I went back there to film just everything really? again, yeah, last year. <laughs> so many nights there. <laughs> yeah, yeah our, our, um, 
our studio was there. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, and you know, you see, the, this is like something that you can do on on After Effects that, yeah. that you just track the the, the uh, some points to to wherever you want. You know, see, see this type of there's a, there's a lot go, going on. So <laughs> it's not even just the the character animation, right? It's a bunch of effects. Yeah. And they're interacting with with us and all. Yeah, but that's <laughs> yeah. Nice. So it's something. Okay. And I can show my uh, my my show reel. Maybe this helps uh, a lot. So this is like the this is my show reel, um, my latest show reel. So these are some of the some of the. Animations that you you, you, you you can expect to to learn on the on the workshop. <laughs> Some of them, I, I it's something that I can teach on 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 a, on a few hours, right? But but uh, I'm sure I can definitely um, you know uh, uh, bring ju just the the knowledge and uh, and and. Um, Autonomy, or uh, maybe like uh, some key channels on YouTube to to follow, and mm -hmm. I'm always looking for uh, looking out for tutorials all the time. Uh, it's a ton of stuff that I'm keep learning. So, <laughs> but this is the kind of stuff that, that I mostly like to do: uh, nice. character animation, stuff like trailers for uh, video games, and even. Graffiti uh, last year, and I, I did a bunch of jobs for like NFTs. Okay. <laughs> right, so that died. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Ines. <laughs> Thank you for showing us Absolutely. everything that you do. Absolutely. And uh, I, I'm sure that uh, all the people seeing know more about you and are Great. even more interested to be with you and to learn from you awesome so thank awesome. you so much thank you thank you for doing this <laughs>